What's up guys, today we're replacing the wiper blades on the 2008 to 2012 Honda Accord. Now overall this is an easy job, it's about a 1.2 out of 5 on the 4 noob scale, but you got to make sure you've bought the right part and there's a few little tricks so let's get right into it. Okay, so you have two options, either replacing just the rubber insert on your wiper blade or the whole wiper blade itself. Now an important thing to know is if you want to go with this option of just the wiper blade, these are only going to fit the original Honda from the factory wiper blades. So as you can see here on this car, this is a Bosch unit. Um, it's not the original Honda unit, so these won't fit. To replace this, we've got to replace the whole wiper blade with something like this. So if you're going with the aftermarket wiper blade, you'll need a 19 inch for the passenger side and a 26 inch for the driver's side. And to make sure that it fits the Honda Accord, you can look on the back and see, make sure that it fits the large J-hook, the 9x4. These right here fit, so I'll have a link to these in the description below. Okay. So first we're going to have to take off our old wiper blade. Now, it may be slightly different depending on what aftermarket blade you've got on there, but in this one, this snaps up. And then we basically, it's like a J-hook like this, so we need to pull firmly down in this direction. And let's see if we can get it. The passenger side was a little hard, but there we go. So you just kind of pull firmly down, and you know, this one's very old, as you can see. Um, so it's a little, uh, takes a little pressure to get that off. Okay, so now we've got our 26 inch for the driver's side. And one tip to know here, be very careful when you've got this lifted up. Um, if you drop this down, you can easily crack your windshield right there. Um, but on this new one, we've got a similar little thing we can lift up. So we lift up here and then we can pry this up a little bit to give us a good angle and then this is just going to slide up in here and then we're going to firmly pull it up in this direction until we hear a click. So right now it seems tight but we haven't heard that click yet so there's that click. And now you can see it's firmly in place. Then we just push that down. Now slide this protectant off. So now that silicone is exposed and we're done. And so then on the passenger side, you're gonna do the same thing with the 19 inch blade. I've already replaced that. So that's it, we're done. Hope this video helped you. If it did, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video.